Hey guys, today I'm going to show you how to make a comic book wallet. For this comic here. This is what it looks like. This is my Calvin and Hobbes one. It has ID holder and everything if you want. So, this is not, this one's not with the real comic. This is with a photocopy. This one's with the real comic since I have so many brothers and sisters, they... Um, really uh, mess up our comic books a lot, so. What you're going to need for this is a comic of your choice. Make sure it's at least 12 by 9. Or, you can make it as big as you want, but this is, this is 12 by 9 inches. Um, if you want it the exact size of your money, then, um, make it 12 by 9, but you can make it bigger if you'd like. So this one's a little bigger, so what you're going to do is you're going to take your comic, measure it out to make sure it's 12 by 9 put together, then um, cover it with tape. So you'll need some tape, this is from the dollar store, then you need a ruler, some scissors, velcro, Hot glue gun if you so choose, or, tape, or double sided tape if you like, and that's all you'll need. I'm going to move this over a little bit. So what you're going to do is you're going to take your comic and cover it completely with tape. It'll make it all shiny and durable. Then um, take your money and don't lay it on the long side. Lay it on the short side. Then what I did right here is I marked out the a little higher than the dollar, as you can see here. So that's what I did. Um, yes. So then what you're gonna after you've done that, you take it and you fold it on that line. So check it, make sure your dollar still fits inside with a little extra, and then use that, now open back up again, and glue that down, or tape if you so choose. Glue doesn't stick well to tape, so uh, I prefer, I prefer double-sided tape, but I, I, I don't have that. There we go. After you've done that, turn it around, fold in on the other side. Like that. Then you glue that side. Don't glue the top, only glue the sides. Because the top is where your money is going to go. Then, if you have any, cut off the excess. And here, and that's how you make a basic wallet. So you fold it in half. That's how you make a basic wallet, like that. But I'm going to take it a step further and make the closure. So what you're going to do is take a comic and make it about three inches long by about an inch wide. So decide which way you want it. Which way you want, want it to go. I want it to go like this. So I'm gonna do, so there's these little folds here. So I'm going to carefully take that apart a little bit, I'm going to do the other side, it's easier. What you're going to do is try to get a little hole in there, 
Use your scissors if you need. This is pretty tricky, so I'm going to use my scissors. Don't worry, don't or don't rip your comic. Sorry about that. So get a little bit of scissors in there if you need. There we go. See, I accidentally ripped that, so don't do that. Before, how about before you glue it, make a little hole. So then you can put that in there. And once you get that in there, add your glue. Or, or this one is easier with the glue. But if you still like, if you'd still like to use your double-sided tape, you can. So when you glue the sides, leave a little hole on the side you want. Don't make that mistake like me. And then what you want to do is, if you'd like, you can cut it a little bit to make it round, a little more round on the sides if you'd like. I accidentally didn't do that. There we go. And then close it. And then take a little piece of Velcro like I've got here. Two sides. Put a blob right there. I prefer I want you to use super glue for this part because Glue doesn't stick to tape that well. So glue it on glue it like that on one side. And then find out where it's gonna go. Or put a little bit of glue right here. Then close it like that. So before you open it, let it sit for a little bit and dry. Yeah, so this one's the real comic, and this one is on cardstock. I prefer that you use the cardstock because this is, this rips pretty easily. I accidentally glued a little bit like that. So once it's dry, you can open it and put your money in there. If you so choose. So if you want to make a pocket, like in this one, like this, that's what I have in here, you take a, pe a part of your comic, cut it out, put tape over it, and then just glue it over the, the bottom of it. So with this one, yeah, with this, you um, measure out the bottom of your wallet and cut a piece of the other, the comic that you printed out or is using with a uh, same size like this and then glue it on. With this ID card holder, this ID card holder, I cut out a piece of an old, an old ID holder, but yeah. That's how you make a simple comic book wallet. Hope you enjoyed it. Hope you can make one for yourself. I give credit to another YouTuber who made this. I'll put her uh, video in the description below. She used a Starbucks bag. But I used her method to make this. Thanks for watching. See ya. See you around in the next one.